Okay, so time section. Rounds until. Okay, so we've got five rounds. We gotta fight people. We gotta hack things. And we gotta shoot people. And we gotta hopefully get that cure. Ooh, this should be interesting. And they're coming in from multiple sides. Well. All right, Gobbit. Here is a terrible plan. Oh, you're already in one spot. Okay, cool. Now let's get Izzy. Izzy, get hacking. Jack in. She was already got killer three. Um, I guess we'll give her medic as well. Medic three. Because for some reason she can't see the stuff we have. Okay. So I can get there in one. Uh, no, no, me. Okay, yep. And then this one. And then me. Okay, locked. Can't find a keyhole. Gotta be unlocked via the matrix. Gotcha. Alright, Duncan. Okay, got Captain, Drone, Drone, Conjurer, Grenadier. Okay. So. I guess this is where we go with this. Well, that was a nasty surprise. All right. Lesson learned. Don't use grenades. <laughs> In fact, I think I think we basically want to reload that fight if we can. Cuz that's real bad. Um, thank you. Okay. So there's the drone control system. Alright, well I guess we'll see how we go, if necessary. If we die, we reload, it's easy. Okay, so. Hack block eyes. Start. Four, one, two, three. Next. Clock in the middle. Not clock, like stopwatch, maybe or whatever. Um this this maybe? This one. It's got a W to do to this one. Done. Accessing the master drone control node, you quickly disable the facility's drone networks. The system hiccups a few times and launches a reboot process. A series of status messages pop up. Apparently, you haven't just deactivated one segment of the drone network. Send every drone in the facility into standby mode. Shouldn't have to deal with any drone based opposition from here on out. Okay, looking mighty fine here. Okay, cool. So, once you are done, I just have to go by here. 
Okay, so yeah, here is where we actually have an enforced fight. Cool, cool. Okay. Let's get ourselves an assassin to help us. So we assassinate you. Nice! Okay, and now we can go for a killer. Oh wait, we can go for this on that, maybe? No? Oh, just on yourself then. Nice. Okay. So I guess we gotta use our eat a spirit thing. Yeah. Because we just don't have the AP to do anything else. Oof. Okay. Um, so. I guess we go with like this. Curses. Okay. Let's move you up over here and give them something to deal with. Better. Ah, for frag's sake! Rude. Super rude. Like, that that is... That they all seem to have AP damaging grenades is super bad for us. They can't seem... They can't seem to hit the broadside of a barn. Helpful. Gotta admit. I guess we'll buff you. And we will kill you. Uh, let's try with a bit of erosion too then. Okay, you. Okay, definitely need to move this then. Okay. So, kill you. Come on! How hard is it to frickin' hit? Okay, I made the right decision there. So you dead? Yes, you are. Shoot you. Shoot you. Okay, great. Alright, so let's see how this goes. You guys move around. Yep. Uh, is there a point where I can hide? Yes. Oh, thank goodness. Hot lab safe control. Um, there's nowhere else for us to go. We'll just force our way through. Don't want to have to deal with it. Disengage the locks. Disconnect. Alright, so we grab this. Got the vial. Patient zero, yeah, yeah. Okay. You just get fucking murdered.
Okay, pop over here. Run over here. Go to the research terminal. Override the SimSense feeds. Um, yep, may cause erratic connectivity issues to subjects, yes. Okay, SimSense feeds overwritten. Pop this guy in the face. Shoot him. 84% chance, sir. And you frickin' scrubbed it. See, he didn't. Now let's get to this unit. Get the antibodies. Nice. And then I guess we just leg it, really. I mean, we could sh fight, but... Let's just run. Oh, lab computer here. Disengage the interlocks. Okay, now we'll override the SimSense feeds and disconnect them. Terminals phrasing seems familiar. Must be talking about what they're talking, doing, potentially dangerous actions. Proceed. Disconnected. Anything else? No. Just defeat the security forces. Does it matter? Oh, right, yes, because we need something from the captain here. How did that line of sight get blocked? Okay, so. Full order him. He's dead. Full order them. Shoot them. Shoot them again. Shoot them one more time. Shoot that guy. Nope. Somehow. Can't. Okay, I mean the system got shut down, that's fine, because we already did all the bits we needed. Also, screw you. Good, got them. Oh, I should have shot that person, whatever. First, done. Now we just need to run. Does this mean we lose? I'm unclear. Uh, eject. Eject. Okay. Just got escape. Cool, cool. Alrighty. That all seems to have worked out. To an extent. There are our subjects. I wonder if they will attack us. A sharp melange of smoke, explosives, and ozone buffer chest sensors. Hear someone calling to you from the podroom. A disheveled brown-haired elf is crouched just inside the door. His bloodied face turns to you to shout above the din of gunfire and screams. Take cover! Okay. Right. So these guys are fighting the security forces. I guess. Or something. Okay, cool. Let's do something. Hydraulic jack. Nice. Nice! 
Okay, we're doing a bit of the old action point smuggling here. So we get a drone nice and close. Actually, what we should do is we should use you. Because you have done the convenience of burst fire. Do not see where the hostile forces are. So we're going to open that door. Ah, there they are. Shoot him. Have her run up. Duncan, you can do the same. You can run up over here. Gob it. Get over here. Oof. Wow. Also, wow. Yeah, okay, so you have priority here. Rude! I need that armor. I use it for things. You jerk faces. So there are also hostile forces up here. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, nice. I guess these guys all get to help us as a result. Okay, so go up here. Ah, just do the old double burst. Gets rid of that fella too. Go see what's in here. Will you, Drony? Well, hello there. I guess here's that medical closet. It is 8236. Bye bye, mage. You move up. And then shoot one guy in the back. You know what? Shoot him again. And then you move up as well. Alrighty, what do we see? Rude. Come on. You gonna do anything there? Oof, yeah. Right, yeah. Good to see that they are actually doing something here. Even if we can't quite see it, that that guy's not in good shape. Bam. Wow, okay. <laughs> that guy is effed. Super effed. He somehow gets more turns than you would have anticipated. They all seem to get more turns than I would anticipate. Okay, cool. So they're all there. So let's now go into the med supply closet and get some sweet med supplies. I'll take it. I can go to stash. And this? Oh yeah, I'll take that too. And it also can go to stash. 
Excellent. So. Come on, chat with him. The elf from before glances wildly around the chamber. When he turns his gaze, you can see his hair is matted with blood. The dark, wet spots in his clothes are more likely more of the same. I sure didn't waste any time before spraying us with bullets. Damn ricochets. You can call me MFI. You know where the hell I am. Don't remember coming down here. Last thing I recall, I was in Kowloon. About to cut a deal for some new ESPs then. Nothing. Hey, same here. I was supposed to meet a Johnson to discuss a data steel job. Next thing I knew, I woke up in this place, inside this cold little room. So you know where we are, stranger? Yeah. You're in a, this is an underwater lab where she was. It takes people for experimentation. You know, the illegal kind. Damn it, really got myself no mess this time. Sure explains the, all this new cyberware, though. I'd planned on buying some wear myself. Would have been nice to pick and choose my own upgrades, but hey, at least this stuff's free. Why else? What did we do to get singled out by Shiawase? I'm just a decker, man. Burned a few corp databases in my time, but nothing worthy of this kind of attention. Hey, me too. I'm mostly just low profile. My name's Virginia H Fizz. It's just in Hong Kong for work. Never been here before this. Isn't this exciting? You're both sinless, right? It's probably why they took you. You wouldn't be missed. Makes sense, I guess. Snatch us off the streets. No one's gonna come looking. We don't exist anyway. Bastards. Look on the bright side. They'll get what's coming to them. No way we're staying trapped down here. How are you getting out of here? We got ourselves a mini-sub. But we can hardly fit ourselves in there. No way we could take anyone else. That's fine. If this is not a water basis, you say, there gotta be more subs around. I'll take anything. And I'll cut my way through Shiawase if I have to. All I know is I'm sure as hell not dying down here like some lab rat. Alright, Fizz. Let's get out of here. Right behind ya. And then they run through this exit. Which is where the other ones were all running. Makes sense that they would have caught some shadow runners in their net. Probably not accidentally either. You hiss along the maglev tracks, the car's interior glowing faintly blue from distant sunlight filtering down through the seawater. In the distance lies Captain Jomo, freedom and an escape from this lab. The only sounds other than the electric humming is the occasional soft bump as the la tram sh shifts tracks. Duncan suddenly lurches toward the window of the tram, cursing under his breath. You're not going to like this, Ranako, but we're headed the wrong way. Did we put the wrong station? I'm betting she was their security pulled us off course so they could ambush us. Doesn't look like the system's malfunctioning or anything like that. The diagnostic says emergency override. Well, we can probably pull the emergency stop lever, it'll be mechanical, so it should be pretty easy to do. Then we could take the maintenance door, get the drop on them, and engage on our own turns. Ultimately, maybe we could rewire the car and get it back on course. I bet we'd encounter less resistance that way, but I don't know what kind of environment we'd be fighting in. Yeah, I'm. I can just drone this out. Override the automated routing system. With the, f uh, f the flips of a few switches and several override commands, the tram's master drone uh, on the tram's master drone channel, you reroute the car back to its original destination. Eh, never mind. It was fine, really. Okay, so yeah, going back through the old digs here. As you move through the lab, monitors around you spring to life. Commander Gara scowls at you from the flickering screens. A look of severe irritation etched into lines along his eyes. Your little romp through Shiawase's property has gone on long enough. Time's up, Shadow Runner. In the distance, you can hear the thunderous clamor of jackbooted feet hammering on metal floors. Seconds later, a team of armed guards in Shiawase uniforms burst into the room. Weapons held at the ready. Okay. Sure, we'll fight you. We'll fight all of you. You really pissed over all this complex runner. The commander spits on the steel floor. Made an awful mess of everything you've come across down here. That's a lot of money you've cost us. But now I've finally got you. No way out but through me and mine. By the time I'm done with you, you'll look worse than those freaks in the cryo tanks. Eh, you corporate drones are all the same. On the contrary, I take great pride in my work. I work hard. Some even consider me the best in my field. The paycheck and health insurance is just a bonus. Most employees are just here to punch time cards. Don't mistake me for one of them. Now I'm going to give you one chance to get out of this thing alive. Surrender and I promise we won't kill you. Can't say what state you'll be in, but at least you won't be dead. Ah, so your plan is to turn me into a murder puppet like your subjects? Then I'll pass, you know. 
You're already a puppet shadow runner. The only real difference between you and the people in those tanks is who's holding the strings. You surrender to us and we make things better for you. Our subjects don't feel any guilt or pain or fear. The machines take all of that away from them. You'll never need or want for anything. This is your last chance. Throw down your weapons or we'll pry them from your dead hands. What'll it be? Not a very con convincing street uh, speech. No sale. And you brought this on yourself. Okay, cool. Well, we uh, go and hide behind this thing. Pulling drones a little closer. Activate both drones. We let Izzy take cover too. Want her to. Ah, uh, you know. Actually, let's bait some grenades. So, I'm gonna move her over here. We're gonna use some grenades of our own. Um, wait, is this even a sensible plan? No. Everyone's had it thus far, so. Well, let's just focus fire on this asshole. Yeah. Okay, dunk it. So, again, we're just, we're literally trying to bait grenades out. Because that is basically free gunfire. And we might as well shoot that man. Gobbit! Alright, fine. This is annoying to have to deal with, but fine, 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 fine. And you die. Um... Of course you miss. It's your last frickin... Hmm. I swear... Hmm. Alright. This you can't dodge. You're dead? Good. I was hoping for some sort of special interaction here. But that's fine. You went down like a chump. And I'm pleased with that. Shoot that one. Shoot him again. Uh, shoot him again. And there you go. Healing, cheating. Now that backfired a bit, didn't it? Okay. <laughs> Lovely. Okay, you. Let's just take this guy out. And again. And why not you? Fair enough. I guess I might as well try and hack you. Donkey. You know what? Actually, move here. Somehow that didn't work. Fine, Duncan. Ah, okay. So first, we do a bit of the old burst fire. And then we do a bit of the old shooting in the face. And then you make the mistake of throwing a grenade at us again, like an idiot. And then you pop over here. And just burst him. Okay. Easy enough. Nothing to grab, just get going. Still got the, the um, guy we subdued right at the start. And we just basically get out of here. Works out pretty well, I must say. Okie dokie. Hello? This is... This is Dr. Tang. Thank you again for letting me leave the lab. For letting me live. Unfortunately, we have a problem. Um, don't leave me in suspense. Tell me what it is. 
Look, here's the deal. I don't know how many test subjects were infected with SARS-3, and it's entirely possible some of the subjects you encountered were carriers. Well, shit. This isn't my fault, I swear. Dr. Ngai never told me about that he'd been testing the disease on the test subjects. It was all done behind my back. If the subjects were indeed, well, infected, that would be bad. That would mean I just... When I released them from the cells, SARS-3 would have begun to circulate the facility. You could have been infected, and I... I can't risk letting that disease get loose again. Anyone leaving the infe- facility needs to be treated with the antibodies you're carrying. No exceptions. Long story short, I need as much of that cure as you can give me. Whatever you don't need for the client and yourself, you got to leave it for me. you got access to your lab. Can't you just whip up another batch? Or, you, you know, you don't have any others stashed somewhere? You took everything we had on hand. That single rack of vials constituted several months worth of SARS-3 antibody production. If anyone down here is infected, there's no way I can produce a sufficient quality of, a quantity of antibodies in time to halt the spread of the disease. People will start dying before I'm halfway done. Hell, it takes longer than we've got to set up the growth medium, let alone produce antibodies for the entire crew. Look, I'll give you everything I have in the bank if you just leave me all the vials you don't need. Obviously, you can keep some doses for yourself and your client. Hell, keep them for anyone else you might be worried about too. There's enough to go around. All I need you to do is leave whatever you don't need where you're standing. Do that, and I'll transfer the noon from my account. Okay, I'll, I may be willing to help you, but only if you help me first. Show me how to use the antidote, and I'll consider leaving what's left for you. Alright, pay close attention. The doctor describes in detail how to administer the antidote without tainting the solution. You promptly dose yourself according to our instructions. Now you've been treated, will you leave the remaining antidote in the sub bay? Um, please, do this for me. I know I run a Shiwase lab. I, you know I run it. I've got the money, believe me. Give me the vials you don't need and you'll be a very rich man. Okay. Yep. You got yourself a deal. I'll have the noon wire to you immediately. Thank you. I mean that. 850 million. So, it's not a huge amount of cash. But, I don't know. I'm, I'm happier with that as an approach. Enough of kicking the hornets today. My radio sounds like a whole nest of them is after you. Let's get out of here, Jomu. And we'll hand the mission in, and then... Next time we'll do the like traditional post run cooldown and then back off. Jomo redlines the submersible throttle and you rocket away from the Shiwase lab in record time. The orc remains glued to the sonar and inertial guidance readouts, constantly scanning for pursuit. Thankfully, nobody seems to be on your tail. Soon enough, you're ascending toward the impound lot, far from the dangers of a germ warfare lab, back to the land of Dow Police, a leaking boat, and an unfriendly city. Home sweet home. Okay. That was so cool, just as a setting, right? I mean, it was really frustrating to be like, oh, here's a super cool item I can use, and then try and use it and just get completely fucked over by it. But, you know, it was a really cool setting, and I love that. Okay. Let's talk to the Quartermaster. Hey Renico, I got a news about that friend of mine. You know, the one who was under the weather? He's been stabilized thanks to you. Looks like he's gonna pull through. Glad to hear it. You should be. I haven't gotten a bad ideal. You want something from my special stock? Just say the word. I'll get you all set up. Let me see your special stock, Sergeant. Ah, it's all guns. I was hoping for, like, a military drone. Anything else? No thanks. Let me see what you got on the rack. Show me the drones. Anything different? No. 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 Nothing different. Anything else? No. See you later, Sarge. Okay. So we got Nuyen. We got... Uh, let's actually hand in the, the quest according to the mission computer. See if we can make sure we got paid for it. If we get, if we were gonna get paid for it, beyond access to sweet new guns that we don't give a crap about. Your workstation, check inbox and new messages. Tag is then infiltration recap. All right, so this is just a recap of what we need to do. Don't care. Open the jobs directory. Claim payment for retrieving the cure for main cow seal. 
You submit the job was finished and await the response. And a few moments later, a message pops onto the screen. Glad to hear the job's done. Payments attached. Good work. Okay, 1700 Not bad. So I've still got one job left. That's cool. Let's check the BBS. Anything on there? Aha. Okay. You know what? We'll check this out next time. Until then, have a great day. Bye.